So I think it's a really exciting time in uh, kidney cancer. Um, uh, we have an agent approved uh, since um, uh, November of 2015, an immune checkpoint with nivolumab. Um, nobody um, is unfamiliar with these agents anymore, and they're obviously used everywhere. But the question really is, where do we go from here? Um, it is an agent, um, if used alone, ha which has moderate activity. Response rates are like around 20%. These can be very durable responses, but it's simply not enough um, if you really want to effectively treat patients with immunotherapy. Um, I think there are several different approaches. One is to combine it uh, with other agents, such as targeted agents. And I think one marriage and that is quite natural is actually combining VEGF inhibitors um, with nivolumab. Um, what we have learned is that it's probably better to use selective agents, such as exitinib, um, rather than sunitinib or pazorpinib, and uh, those combinations are moving forward in phase three clinical trials. We have some data emerging um, from smaller phase two trials with very encouraging activity, very high response rates, um, as presented, uh, for example, at ASMO in the combination of exitinib and pembrolizumab.